So recently I realized, hey, I can code. So I asked you guys the question to come up with the worst website ideas so I, with my powerful coding hands, can warp them into existence. So first suggestion is a volume system based on RNG, which means that if I click something, the volume should randomly do some stuff. So here's the website, which I have so nicely coded in this short bit of JavaScript, but anybody who knows JavaScript knows that a short bit of JavaScript feels like an eternity in hell. So here is the website. So let's change the volume. It did not do, wait, it actually did what I wanted. <laughs> uh, let's put it all the way down. That's not all the way down. Let's try again. So if I now play this music, it's gonna be very quiet. It's relatively quiet. So, um... Let's try to get it as loud as I possibly can. I don't think it's gonna go any louder than that. Alright, are you ready? Make a login page, but when you log in, you have to play a game of Minesweeper, and if you lose, the account gets deleted. That is evil, but I will make it anyways. So if you thought I was smart, then you should stop thinking that, because I stole most of, most of the Minesweeper code of this guy, Nick Arako. I don't know if I pronounced that correctly. So basically, if you want to go play Minesweeper on some somebody's open source project, um, I will leave a link in the description. Uh, I will also leave a link to GitHub with all of my websites in there and a link to my Discord, which I won't plug in this video because that's just lame. So let me check out the website. Here we have a login screen. My username is I actually don't like cheese and my password is I lied. Um, so here, now I have to verify that I'm not a bot, and I don't know why I made this border around it. But, um, let's go. Alright, my account already got deleted because I clicked on a bomb. Let's just log in with Daylight Gaming, which is the name of my YouTube channel that you should absolutely subscribe to. Um, so this, it does this thing where I'm an idiot, um, but I will fix that. Probably won't, but, um... So this is a lot of information we can be working with. If you have like two ones next to each other, that means you shouldn't be clicking there because there's probably a bomb. All right, my account was also deleted. Let's hope we get a thing where we actually get to try this time. So um, I will just click the smiley face. All right, so I actually can do something now. Um. I'm just gonna guess this one is over here. I was correct. So, uh, yeah, so I could click that and I don't think you can follow along, but I'm probably just gonna speed up this footage anyways because it's boring as fuck. I am actually going to win this. I did not expect that. Um, so now I've just jinxed my entire existence and I'm probably not going to win this. I said so. Um, that's not even rage worthy. I know you're like waiting for like me to rage funnily, but I was expecting that. So, um, yes. So this is the first non-evil idea of the day, which is a website where just the text and backgrounds are all random color. And this was actually fun to make. So this is the website and it looks like absolute shit, like some five-year-old made this, which is kind of true, but I'm actually not five anymore. Um, so what this does is every time you reload the page, you get a new color for every element. So if you keep spamming the five, the F5 key, you get a party and I should say if you suffer from any kind of epilepsy then you should skip to this timestamp because I'm about to break it down. Now we have the absolute worst thing I ever made. Make a cat punchable. So here we have the cat and you can punch it 
So yeah, that's the thing. All right, now make the cat want to throw him hands. So the cat is still punchable. So I'm just going to keep punching it. I don't know if it's become evil because I haven't really changed the coat. So apparently I'm dead now. Um, so rest in peace me, I guess. <laughs>